it's yellow. Yeah, it's a little bit yellow. Man, I just had uh, the best, most perfect calming experience with a, with a friend. I didn't know they're such a good friend. Um, a husband and wife and their, their babies. And just wonderful, very smart people. And they live off-grid, um, closer here, towards the Redwoods, I'll say, from where I'm at. And, man, and, and just a really perfect experience after a semi-emotional breakup here recently in the past few days to bring me back to earth and bring me back to calm, confidence that there's joy in life. <laughs> so it definitely is. And I'm so happy. Oh, it's a gate. I'm so happy to be re-inspired for my dream, um, my sharing society dream, for how I want to help uh, contribute to the world. You know, being more positive and awakening, and you know, I don't know how well the lighting is. I hope it's fine. Oh man, such a wonderful thing. They had a baby girl, and she immediately just wanted to hold my hand and walk with us when we were walking to check out their solar array. Amazing, huge structure. And then she, she they said she doesn't do that to everyone. She just immediately was clinging to me. Um, and that's just so amazing to, <laughs> to just get the love of a child, someone who barely, you know, when it doesn't know you, but they, they know they can trust you. Beautiful blue eyes on that baby girl. name too. And checking out, I came here to mainly check out their solar system and I may just have learned what my friend Dimas over on the coast is trying to solve with using um, car battery banks as, you know, a home battery backup system. That's, that's what they're using here. <laughs> Similar cells and so I'm going to, wow, let's just serendipity to that. And I wouldn't be here I, don't, I wouldn't be here meeting these people or seeing them and, and something tomorrow if I didn't just break up with who thought I was the love of my life. Um, so there's that serendipity too. Wow, that moon. Um, tomorrow, I just got a text, so I'm staying in my hometown of my mom's instead of going back to my off-grid location. And I just learned it like, I just figured out that it's where I'm living at. This place is, is nicer, a little bit nicer. They're renting for 1500 out of a cabin and a yurt. And they said a yurt rented for 850. I'm like, whoa, that's, I could do that. If I had my own location, that'd be more private. Right now I'm living with a woman I'm helping for cheaper. But I have work to do around the place and do errands and pick up groceries. And uh, my ex, when she was visiting, just, just really told me that I do a lot for this woman and I kind of, doing too much than what I'm getting out of the relationship and I don't, I don't think that's true I think I'm getting enough work and it was, a, it, was, it was the opportunity for me to take to advance my life and working on the projects and even sharing society and she's totally down she helps people all the time very much she's a very lovely woman very much into helping people we just gave some of the food that she gets to my friend who needed food who also lives like up on a hill somewhere for the time being and who is kind of my therapist and helped me out through this emotional time. You probably know, you'll know her very much. My friend from in town. Call her C2.0, that's what I'll call her. Until I figure out if I want to use names yet. I'm not going to use names on this live stuff, I'll save it for the documentary. And now I'm being more upfront with my plans of actually what I'm going to do with these videos. But anyway, let's get back to where what I was talking about that you're in the... the a little girl she was trying to, she was like tickling my armpit, but just, she was just so loving and it was so natural and the things we talked about were just really cool, cool stuff. He was talking about drones and that kind of, you know, getting into business using a drone and there's actually a viable market for this uh, 3D mapping 
and she's reselling things on this other site that's competing with eBay and now like, whoa, I can plug that into the sharing society or use that as an example of what we want to build with sharing societies. Buy, sell, and trade feature coming up. <laughs> no no, no uh, release date yet. Sorry. Um, it's so liberating just finally being able to know that I'm going to record this video and I'm going to post it. And even though I'm not marketing them yet, that I, I just, I'm not, I don't feel um, afraid or ashamed anymore or worried. I just, holding back names for now. And it's amazing. It's like this full moon. It's like this road that leads to the redwoods. Just, uh, life goes really spiking down and back up really fast and that's I think thank God for that and thank uh, just the ability to let go it really it'll do you wonders for your mood baby <laughs> so that was great I can wrap it up how long is this six minute video that's where I should keep my videos at now this six minute mark or so so I don't ramble on brag about my wonderful experiences so much, but at least I'll uh, be positive when I do it. None of this droning like somebody warned me about. But peace and love to everyone. Oh yeah, tomorrow I'm meeting this guy I met at the charging station at, at Costco, and he's like really wants to learn about how I want to help the homeless and stuff like that, and he's from the next county. Oh boy, he wants me to be early, so I'm, that's why I'm staying kind of in town. Man, all this stuff, back to back, at the right time. Amazing. Just uncanny. All right, peace and love, all of you. Hope to update you more. Maybe I'll start to use Steam it and post this on Steam it. Why not? I mean, it's potential free money. And they like, you know, DTube vlogging crypto starting to get back and in, get into this crypto market you know I tried to do a little writing on it before and wasn't really making money but I want to build a brand you know and it's crypto's the upcoming thing and it's just amazing things you can do like steam it where you can blog and it's decentralized and you get money out of a pool of basically investors it looks like people that put money into the steam it system and currency you get a piece of that if you put out good content people vote you up it's so new it's incredible so peace and love cheers to new markets and new adventures and new plans and moving forward good night